Hello, I'm Dr. Kirk Volker. I'm a pulmonary critical care doctor who specializes in smoking cessation. Here to answer some of the questions you may have on quitting smoking. Dr. Volker, why should I quit smoking? All right, well, if you look at most of the health problems in the United States today, those who are smoking uh, contribute significantly to the health problems, whether it be coronary disease, whether it be a stroke, uh, whether it be cancers. Uh, and that is the reason that you should quit smoking because you're less likely to, to die. What is the best way to quit smoking? You know, everybody's individual and there is no best way. But I can tell you if you plan for it and reach out to somebody that has a support network um, such as the 1-800-QUIT-NOW, uh, uh, you know, the uh, Florida Department of Health line, you get some support and you plan for it, your chances of success are much better than just trying to do it cold turkey on your own. And what are some resources that I could use to quit smoking? You know, Florida is fortunate in that we have the three ways to quit. There's one number which I believe is 1-800-QUIT-NOW. They have online uh, ways to help you quit smoking. They have group sessions through Florida AHEC, A-H-E-C, um, and they have telephone counseling. All those, they will provide you free nicotine replacement, you know, the patches or the gum. So it's, it's a no-lose situation. How about the e-cigarettes? Are they any better than regular cigarettes? Right now we don't have enough data on e-cigarettes to tell you that you should, uh, oh, I'm sorry. Uh, actually, uh, are e-cigarettes better than regular cigarettes? Well, okay, if you think about it, in a regular cigarette, has probably about 60 toxins in it that cause cancer. It probably has about a thousand or so toxins altogether, but it has about 60 toxins that can cause cancer. Um, let's say an e-cigarette has two or three cancer-causing agents. So I guess in that way it's better, but still do you really want to have be ingesting cancer-causing agents? That's a good point. Do you have any other tips to quit smoking or anything else you'd like to add? Yeah, you know, this is an individual process, and you're going to quit when you're ready. Again, you should plan for it. You know, a lot of people are either stress smokers or habit smokers, or they're physically addicted. And if you go to somebody that knows what they're doing and can help you through the process, they can focus on what you do when you get in those stressful situations, or how to break that habit, or if it's an addiction problem, then what medicines are best to help you break that addiction? Again, think about it, reach out for help, you know, go to somebody who knows what they're talking about, like the Florida Quit Line. Thank you. Okay.